tainu i te waka taupiri te maunga Waikato te awa. Waikato tanifa rau, he piko he tanifa, he piko he tanifa. Ko pōtutau te whero whero o te tangata. Ko Waikato, me ngāti koti mana, oku iwi, ko ngāti māhuta, ko ngaitai, ko ngāti tama oho, ko ngāti whanaunga, ko ngāti pawa, oku hapu, ko Charlotte Graham. Ahau. I'm a practicing artist, a educator, a researcher, and I'm a mother of four children. This is my studio here. I call it the broom room. It's my first opportunity at having a studio. I've got four kids, so I usually worked from my home. And I work at my kitchen table and just making the studio life merge together, I guess. That's what a mama does, and that's how I've had to do it. It's a um, small space and it's been great in that it's given me the opportunity to take my art life out of the house. I've been an artist for 20 years now and the works range from paintings to installation, billboards, moving image works and currently looking at a new series of paintings that are environmentally driven. Over the last 14 years the works have been based on land and people and our environment. Making art is a constant giving and so in order to replenish I go to the water to try and find clarity. I paint raindrops as a pūre, as a way of showing cleansing and healing. I use the birds to speak about things that we need to address in life. Birds speak to us, they have messages for us, and birds, they talk about things that are polemic for us today. Some of the birds might say, frack off, Aotearoa is not for sale, whether it be walking the land, walking in a protest, listening to something that makes my blood boil. The works that I make tend to address those issues. This Project Colours is an opportunity for me to give back to an organisation that would look into helping people with research around dementia. Uh, my grandmother had dementia and it impacted on our family strongly. So if I could assist in anything to do with that, that would be awesome. I like to walk with my paintbrush art shapes society and society shapes art and it's really where the inspiration for all of my works conceptualised from. <laughs>